Hi, this short video shows how to use the great search functionality in Wing X. There's a button in the bottom right hand corner that looks like the little search logo. Just go ahead and tap on that. That'll bring up a box that allows you uh, to select the nearest airports. What Wing X does is it takes a look at your current position and shows you your nearest airports. So this list shows you nearest airports. Uh, San Jose which it is showing on 272 degrees, 2.9 miles west, and the longest runway is 11,000 feet. It has an ILS. So just right off the bat, you get a great situational awareness of what's around you. If you want to go fly an ILS or you're a jet, you want to get a long runway, that's giving you all that information. If you simply tap on, for example, uh, let's tap on Moffat. If we simply tap on that, WingX will take you to Moffat and center it. Now if you leave it a few seconds, it'll jump back to your current position, but that's just a quick way of getting to an airport and taking a look at, at the surroundings. Let's tap on uh, the search functionality again. If we tap on this big red direct to button, well, we'll go direct. So if you have an, an emergency, engine failure, or some engine fire, or some major problem, you really want to go direct to, or you want to just land for whatever reason, just tap on the red D, the direct, and Wing X will take you direct to that airport. You can also click on nearest VORs and it'll show you the VORs and favorites. And if you have any favorites, it'll show you favorite airports and nav aids and, and, and your favorite waypoints. There are a few other really nice things. Uh, first of all, you can search for um, an, an airport. Um, you can give it, let's say, for example, we want to search for Fresno. We can type in Fresno and completely mess up the spelling. And WingX finds Fresno. When you're bouncing around and you don't have time to think too much about spelling, this works very, very well. You can sit for hours and, and uh, try, <laughs> try to figure out misspellings of, of names, but uh, I, that, that is a very, very nice feature. So that's the search functionality. Very simple, very compact, but it gives you nearest airports, nearest VORs, your favorites, direct to, all your information about the airports and whether there's an ILS, longest runway, plus you can enter the, the ID, the name, or the city, or a part thereof. So you don't have to enter uh, Fresno, for example. Let's say we're searching for uh, San Francisco. We can just enter Fran Cisco, and I'm deliberately messing up the spelling. And there's San Francisco. So thank you for watching this short video. Um, I do uh, highly recommend that you play around with the search functionality and see um, how it works. Plus, it'll give you an insight into kind of how badly you can make the spelling and still have WingX find that for you. And from our testing, it, it's pretty good. It, it finds it most of the time. And hope you enjoy that.